Marine, come in. Marine, McNeil to Marine. Marine, I've just started picking up massive power and energy fluctuations in Delta. I've never seen these types of fluctuations before. It's going to be right. It's almost like the entire complex is facing out of some kind of electrical exchange. Alright, so we've got to get to the teleporter quick, otherwise we're just going to die because we just turn off the life support, eh? Yeah, that was a good move on us. Uh... We've got to turn on the skywalk though. Whoa! It's like a mancubus, but I don't know what's with it. It's like a super mancubus that dies after a couple punches. With the, 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 it's berserk, so I'm doing like five times as much damage. It's so weird. It's like the soul cube. It's just use it, then you win. Initially, it was a little bit pointless, and then it's like, oh, by the way, it does berserk, so it suddenly becomes extremely strong, and then it's like, oh, it makes you invincible as well. I think we're all good. Oh snap, yep. Use it. <laughs> there you go, there's the arch file. I, I said last point, I was like, oh, at least there's no arch files. Why would I fight this guy without invincibility? Punch you, punch you, punch you. Oh, I just punch that guy just normally. Ouch. Crap. Use it again! <laughs> I know it seems really cheap, but hey, hey, they give it to you. Would a game designer really just give you the ultimate weapon ever and not have any downsides to it? Oh wow, what do you know? I just got to the teleport. Oh crap. Yeah, I'm out of fingers. I'm gonna fight that guy. Legit. No, I don't. I don't have to do it. Punch! Get out of here! As long as no one else spawns. Yeah, okay, I get, I'm getting away now. What do I have to do? Do I have to scan for the thingos? Ah, uh, no. I don't have a thingo. Okay, now we actually get to attack the guy. Normally. Keep spamming the grenades. It's working apparently. Oh crap! Oh crap! Oh crap! I'm a smart. Oh, did you die? Okay. Well, whoa, gosh. And now we are in Delta Labs Unknown. Ooh. To be quite honest, we are pretty much at the end of the game now. According to the map list. As I keep saying, because I've never played this game before. I'm doing it like 100% blind. So yeah, um, I gotta reset the video. I don't 
Whoa, jeez. Oh, crap. Okay. Alright. All good. Let's keep on fire. That's not good. Don't mind if I just take your uh, souls. Welcome to your death. Keep shocking the guys with the rockets up. Rocket shoulders. Intriguing. Also, by the way, BFG! Oh yeah! I'm not gonna use it. Not straight away, at least. Bio signal lost? Okay. That was a really interesting way to die. I don't know what happened then. It's probably an explosive barrel or something. I can't jump this as well. This is just like a good one. Welcome to your death. Hang on. Actually, you know what? Since there's a guy around the corner. Select the fist, there you go. Oh my goodness, I had enough time for that. Why am I using the double shotgun for these guys? Alright. Ah, clean! Perhaps it's a really lazy way to just design new sections by just taking the old section. Holy crap, they're naked! What the heck? Quite steamy, to be honest. Hmm. Are we going here? Here we are going here. Them and these steamy guys. Whoa, hello. Actually, you can just got in, so I'll just take you on. So, anyway, I may as well give my impressions of this. Uh, like. Okay, what the frick killed me then? What killed me? Nothing did. What? Okay, um, some of the design in this game is a little bit weird, but I like some of the new art, the new items. I think, yeah, the artifact is like the soul cube. It's a little bit OP by the end. At least you can't. At least you can't infinite, infinitely spam it. If you know what I mean, you can't. You, you have to acquire the stuff, and so basically they can control how often you use it, which is good. Um, and as for the double shotgun, yeah. Also, I found, I found it kind of interesting about those guys, but other than that, the new enemies, they keep chucking those guys that shoot the... that shoot the blue beams. Like the imps, but not quite the imps. They keep checking those guys around a lot, which is really odd. System shutdown. Uh, they also check these guys around a little bit. So yeah, it's kind of interesting how many of these enemies are new and whatnot, and exactly like what 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 are they and whatnot. I don't know. Actually, I can jump. Yeah, yo. Alright. So I'm gonna... Just... Use a kind of... Here. Um... Yeah. I'm a little bit mixed towards it. Okay. 
Okay, some of my thoughts were a little bit odd, but other than that. With all this stuff. Whoa! Well, I wasn't expecting that. Just dump me in a new section. Okay, sure. Can't keep space and time alright? Sure. Other than that though, yeah, it, it started off being kind of cool because I was in like a mines and then they just took me straight out of it. Into the space base again. In fact, there was even less outdoor sections. I only went outside like twice, really. Oh, the sewer part was pretty cool as well, but... Yeah, likewise, I don't know, this is a bit of repetition with the environments, again. It's a guy, yeah. We kept going around in circles at like the same speed. Anyway, um, oh geez, I haven't been here before. Uh, what else? Other than that, though, yeah. It's basically just what I thought. Oh gosh. It's basically about what I just thought about Doom 3, just again. In a bit of a shorter experience. Ah! Okay, that one was my fault. Why is the kind of in caps? Because my caps lock is on, that's why. Ah, I'm a little bit irritated by exactly just how many times I've been dying in this past area. But yeah, other than that though, most of the design has been there pretty much, if you know what I mean. Yeah, now that you're there. So yeah, that's about it. Now, doing all this in one go is kind of weird. Keep going. Whoa, gosh. Still wasn't expecting that, but okay. Oh yeah, and the freaking grabber. It was like overpowered at first and then it just decided it was like, nah. Because then by that stage, just all the weapons, <laughs> it, it became really inefficient. So it's kind of weird, really. The design's just kind of hit and miss, really. That's the time. Oh, yeah, good. Just back up into the fire. Yeah. Yeah, I'm a clever. Um. Yeah, other than that, we're pretty much almost there. Again, into the fire. What? What am I doing? Hey, hey do you have health? Oh, the health station decided to wait. Wait. Yeah. Yeah, good. Ugh! Oh my gosh!
Hey, hey, health station, do you wanna, like, come up? Ooh, actually. I think that was some guy's PDA around here. Medkit, okay, that works. Until I burn myself. Oh, these freaking burns. May as well. Bend. Yeah, thank you for reusing locations. Appreciate it. Oh my gosh, like, I hate it when they jump. This is just like, what, what can you do? Got any health? Anywhere? No? Alright. On to the kind of again. Alright, come on, go up. No health anywhere. Got that guy. So I'm kind of feeling like I'm gonna do that again. I'm good. Du -du -du. Good old double shotgun is there, so I'm happy. Other than that, all the, all the new enemies are kind of weird. <laughs> I was thinking, hmm. Again, why are all the health stations out, though? It's not very good for your health if the health stations aren't there. Like, that's pretty annoying, because you can tell that they were health stations, so... Alright, where am I going now? I think I'm going in here? Yeah. Oh, gosh! Jeez. Yeah, I think I've been here before. Well, may as well. No. I guess not. Oh gosh. Thank you, game. Appreciate it. And now we're back in hell. Okay. Well, I will see you guys next time. Actually, you know what? Since this is the last part, even with the expansion, I will drag this on. So yeah, I thought it was a good expansion to the game. But again, like, it still has the, it still has kind of the same problems that, um, that the main game had. It just had quite a lot of imbalance issues. You would get some things that just weren't, that's good. oh crap, no, they're just Gakos. Gakos can't follow me, oh no, these guys can. Alright, that's it. Gone. All right, now I actually have to shoot. Hey, I haven't seen you guys in a while. Oh crap, baby face. Oh crap, baby face. Okay, punch a baby face. Oh gosh. Whoa, jeez. Okay, I'm doing it. Oh my gosh. Saving Chuck. I don't know why, I've just been finding myself just constantly getting hit because. And if enemies would just be in like really annoying placements for some reason. Um, yeah, I'm 
content to, to just do a kind of. Yeah, thought so. Jesus, this is a lot of guys. Oh crap, floating platform as well. There's just a lot of guys and stuff, and you're kind of forced to use it. It's like they did their playtesting on the effects of the, the item that's kind of OP. Oh my gosh! And again, they this game was really stingy on health. I always found myself just, just being low on health all the time. And yeah, oh my gosh! Oh! My goodness. I think that's kind of my fault for actually ending up in this kind of situation. Yeah, thank you, game. For presenting all these enemies. I can't take out. Yeah, give me like four big guys on like eight HP. Yeah, thanks. Appreciate the game. All right, come on, come on. BFG. Yep, yep, Mancubus. Oh gosh. Okay, that's it. Backing up. We're backing up because, like, dude, what? I was just, I am on low health for this entire part. There have been absolutely zero items to give me more health. And I'm like, dude, he presents so many enemies. Oh my gosh! Oh, I haven't progressed at all in four minutes, because I spawn in low health. It's like, okay. So I'm like, okay. You know, it'd be nice if they actually gave me health until I got past like five rooms with these guys. This is a really odd way of adding challenge, isn't it? What? Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, my gosh. I know, I know. It's supposed to be hard, but, like, dude, what? It's not hard. It's like, I can't take a hit, because it's like... I'm not being restocked before any of these enemies.
Take it. Whew. And it's like switching to the fist. Can't really do that. The berserk switches you to the fist straight away because it's like, okay, if you're gonna go berserk, you want to switch to the fist. I'm saving on the kind of slot again. What the heck? He has taken five shotguns. Gosh! What? Gosh! Gosh sake! Okay. Oh gosh! Okay, it has literally been 10 minutes since I've gone in and I've barely made any progress. There's nothing over here! Nothing over here. Huh, it's weird, I got sent to hell and yet I've got all my weapons, I just realized that. I mean, I knew I had all my weapons, but like, it's kind of weird how come I had all my weapons this time and not the previous time. Alright, so I get all that, get BFG ammo, then I get sent here, okay? Use this straight up. Use fist, punch, punch, punch. So I'll use it again. Punch, 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 punch. Use it a third time. Punch, punch. Do they just expect you to use it so many times? And even after all that punching, there are still two guys in the Mancubus left. Three guys in the Mancubus left. Alright, so I'll activate it again for the fourth time. Jeez. Because, like, if you tried using it before, it's like, oh no, now you don't have enough. Well, this is honestly the final boss. In that case, it's kind of weird. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are we still doing this? How do you take on this so many enemies? In a fog nonetheless. Because I can't really see that much. Oh. May as well. Didn't work as good as I intended. Okay. Are we good? We're good. Oh, gosh. That transition. Hey, you know, it'd be nice some health. No, 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 I said health. I said health. I oh, lost soul. This 
where I came in from? I got nope. It just looks like the same pod, just backwards. Or is it? Oh yeah, good. It's the place I came in from. Out what? Oh, never mind. Dude, I have three armor, two elf. No clue where to go. This is a recipe for success. Ah, oh, dude. The health is right there. You do not need to send enemies my way. I, ju I, ju I, ju I just want to grab the health. Okay, thank goodness I can grab the health now. I'm just going to stay on the other side. And there is more plasma over there. I don't, need, I don't really need more plasma, to be honest. It's not worth going all the way back. Oh, crap. Whoa. Actually, you know what? No. Wouldn't work. Go! Grenade! See, that's how... That's how effective the grenades are. Not at all! Look at that! Chuck's like seven at him. Let's take out that one guy. Alright, I've got a machine gun, but I don't feel like using that. I've got a chain gun, but I'm probably gonna wanna use that. Hmm. Very nice. Oh crap! Yeah, of course you would. Why wouldn't you? Why wouldn't you, game? Why wouldn't you? Alright. That was, that was good. Final boss, yeah! Nope, we're just gonna check another one at you. Come on, cacos, come on, cacos, I'm gonna hit ya with my gun. Do I have to go over here or do I have to go down there? No clue, let's save. <laughs> Whew. Nope, it's just a very convenient bottom part. Why do they do this? That one looks like it's got like a body down there. Oh, crush. See that. Okay, you know it would be nice, some health packs, like, a lot of them, maybe this is where I need, where I'll get my health packs. This guy over here, that's good, there's a guy down, there's a couple of guys down there, there you go, I like these giant skulls, I wonder where they get them from. Okay. Well, 
What did you hope to accomplish by coming here, mortal? Die! You have something that belongs to me. And I want it. Well, let's take him on. Save it. Alright. Oh, gosh. Uh, shoot him. Shoot the souls. Now. There's a gun. There's a gun. Okay, okay, so what am I doing? What am I doing? I'm thinking of... Okay, so I'm thinking of shooting him, but like... Question is, how do you shoot him from this angle? You just keep firing... Fireball, oh gosh, okay, so I'll load it again. How do you... How do you hit him? Is like machine gun? I guess that's working a little bit. Ouch. Ah, I'm on fire. Is he already on fire? Gun, maybe. Alright, so I guess I gotta just shoot him, but I gotta deal with other enemies. I can't shoot him normally because he just kind of dodges. Actually, I'll go chain gun because I've got some ammo for that, I guess. Whoa. Chain gun, go, go, go. Alright, I got him. Jeez, I can't shoot. Absolutely no clue where he is. Half the time, he blends in. He's a brown grayish enemy that hides in the shadows, and this place has literally no light. Oh crap. Go on, move on. Whoa, gosh. Is he at? Anyway, keep shooting! Keep shooting! Maybe he's, he'll pull Ridley and just kind of fight on the ground. I was thinking I should use the item, but it's like, how will I shoot him? You know? Or how will I punch him? Because I can't really punch him while using the thing, so I'm like, what's up there? I guess I could use it in slow motion. Yep, I'm using it. And the one time I... I use it, he's doing that. So yay. Complete waste of the thing I... Rockets! Ouch. Alright. Alright, alright, yeah. Yeah, I see how the- Oh, I think his wings represent his health. Either that or... His wings are just like that the entire time. I like other things. Holy crap. Whoa, jeez. Alright, so I'm out of that. Is there any way I can recover it? Well, yeah, this guy over there. Keep 
shooting and reloading and probably move over to the other guy. See, just constantly firing stuff. All over the place. Okay, where is he at? Where is he at? Oh! That apparently won! Oh no! That worked! That was pretty cool. Marine? Marine, welcome home. Yeah, yo. Okay, so yeah, that was Doom 3 Resurrection of Evil. Um, some of the scenarios were pretty cool, although some of the design just got a bit annoying, like especially at the end. Like that final boss, I was a little bit unsure about if I was hitting him or not, so I was assuming that I was just shooting him, which I think it was, it was that, but some of the bosses were pretty cool. In fact, the other the three guardian kind of guys, like those, the guys that gave me the abilities for the artifact, that was they were pretty cool. Um, the grabber was not used really that much. In fact, he kind of felt a little bit gimmicky. It was like, oh yeah, half like that. Oh no, no, we can do it as well. Um, other than that, though, what else? Um, the artifact. A little bit of an OP item, really, because everything just revolved around it. But thankfully, thankfully, it was something that was used a lot. Um, other than that, though, what else was there? The double shotgun, that was about it. So, yeah, other than, other than that, I guess it's a good expansion, although I don't really see the point of it that much. I guess it's like a master levels for Doom 2 and whatnot. You know, it's just, it's just have some more fun with the stuff. And then, yeah, pretty much that. I don't really have that much to say about it other than, I guess, yeah. Just play it. Ah, uh, gosh, so, yeah, we're done with Doom. Now, I'm recording this on December 1, and... First of all, I recorded the entire thing in one go, that was pretty cool. Um, the entire ROE pack. But other than that, I'm probably going to be getting into a regular LP. Uh, well, I'll try and get Hexen done, because I'm assuming Hexen's going to be going on for a bit longer, but, um, once both of these are done, which this is done anyway, then I'll be probably leaning into more console LPs, because I'll have the capture card thing all set up. I've got, I've got the capture cards, it's just I, I don't have a way to record it. Holy snap, 3Wave Software owns Capture the Flag. Activision! Now oh, Bethesda <laughs> makes their game or publishes some of their games. Okay, and of course play it on Nightmare if you want. Okay, I'll see you kids next time. I'll see you kids later. See you guys.